So now we're going to go ahead and work out a problem. So question one reads, the average price of gas has been shown to be linearly related to the number of hundreds of cars sold per day in a particular city. So somebody's already found the R coefficient and decided it was close enough to positive or negative one. And so we have our given set of data and we would copy that into the table and then create all of our other columns. Now keep in mind you actually would have done this when you were finding R and determined that there is a strong negative coefficient. So now I need to find A and so I take my A formula and the numbers off of the table that we just created in both my numerator and my denominator to get this 6.24 number that's divided by the 0.85 number and A equals 10.69993, etc. I also need B for my regression model. So again, I follow with my N and my different totals of different columns. Now remember in the denominator though, actually I've written it out, but since it's identical, I still get the 0.5836 number but I go ahead and calculate my B number. So I'm ready to make that regression equation. Y equals A plus BX. So first thing I need to do is say Y equals, ooh, don't forget the X. I forgot, everybody forgets the X. I forgot to tell you what you forget. Okay, so first thing I need is Y equals A. For A, I need to round to three places after the decimal, and that 9 is going to round up because of the 9 after it, which is going to spill into the 9 before it, which is going to spill into the 6. And we're going to get 10.700. Now, normally the file or the formula says plus B, but keep in mind I can see that B is a negative number, so I went ahead and just wrote minus. I'm rounding B to three digits after the decimal. The th second 7 will stay a 7, and I have 2.707. I now have my regression model, and the whole point is to make a prediction. What is the predicted number of cars sold in hundreds when the price of gas is $3 per gallon? Answer with one digit after the decimal. Okay, so I'm going to take my regression model and plug a 3 in for X because X is the price of gas, and X was my average price of gas in dollars, column, row, whichever you want to look at it. So I take the regression formula, and where x is, I plug in a positive 3 to get 2.579, rounding to one place after the decimal per the directions, and I expect to sell 2.600 cars when the average price of gas is $3 a gallon. And keep in mind, when uh, gas gets expensive. Some people think, oh, I'm not going to buy a car. I'd rather take the bus. As gas gets cheaper, more people are like, heck, might as well buy a car. I can afford it. It's cheaper than the bus. Who knows? It keeps changing.